thought I'd share with you my DIY for the Dark Angels Cleanser by Lush. Um, I completely agree with supporting Lush because all their products are natural and handmade and they're really really awesome so it's a great company to support but if for any reason you completely can't afford their products or they're out of stock which the Dark Angels Cleanser often is then it's great to be able to make them for yourself. And also you can make a really big batch for really cheap and give it to your friends and family as a gift. It makes a really awesome gift because it's a really great cleanser. So for this all you need is some activated charcoal which if you guys have watched any of my previous DIYs you'd realise that I use it in so many things. It's such a great thing to be able to use for eyeliners and face masks, for blackheads and acne and all sorts of things like that. So do get it if you can afford it. Um, I get it from iHerb and I'll link that in the description box below. You also need some avocado oil which is a really great deep moisturiser. You need a bit of um, vegetable glycerin which kind of helps keep the consistency of it. It's an emollient so that's the purpose of it in this recipe. Um, you can also get that from iHerb or from a pharmacy or something like that. It's quite cheap. And you also need a bit of clay which I use bentonite clay for this. It's just an Indian healing clay. But you could use other clays. And also you need something to work as the exfoliant. So. For this and the Lush recipe they use uh, black sugar I think, which I don't really have access to around here and I could have ordered some online but there's so many other things you can use for the exfoliating effect, you could use a different sugar. I decided to crush up some cinnamon scroll because it keeps its texture as an exfoliant by itself, it doesn't um, kind of dissolve into the mixture which is great and you can crush up as much as you want and cinnamon also has a lot of benefits for your skin as well it's said to help with collagen production and reducing signs of aging and just be good in general for fighting acne and things like that as well so this is kind of a cinnamon um, version of the Dark Angels Cleanser which kind of makes it even more power packed against acne and blackheads and things like that and it's really good at reducing the oiliness of your skin. I find that it does make my skin quite dry straight after so if you do have quite dry skin you probably this probably isn't the best thing for you but um, you can just moisturize your face afterwards as well. So to get started all we're going to need is about a tablespoon of your exfoliant whether it's the black sugar or the crushed cinnamon. For the cinnamon scroll you just chuck it into a mortar and pestle and crush it up until you've got kind of a fine powder but not as fine as you'd normally purchase cinnamon so it keeps its kind of exfoliating effect. You're also going to need is about four or five capsules of activated charcoal and that is about a tablespoon of activated charcoal and about a teaspoon of bentonite clay. You're also going to need about one and a half teaspoons of vegetable glycerin and one and a half teaspoons of avocado oil. So just mix that up and see what consistency you end up with. It does tend to be quite a dry consistency which is nice because you can take out a kind of pea-sized amount of it and add a little bit of water to it and then cleanse your face. But if you want it to be more runny as it is, you could add a little bit more oil or a little bit more glycerin. Just have a play and see you know, what you want personally. But this is the way it turns out and it's really great, really easy to use. Just scrub it into your face gently, all over your face. You can leave it sit there for a couple of minutes to take effect and then just wash it, wash it off gently as well. Make sure you don't use a white face cloth or anything like that because it does colour it black. So it's easy just to use your fingers or use a dark face cloth to wash it off. So I hope you guys found this useful. It's really, really simple to do. And I hope you guys check the description box for any further details or for my social media or anything like that. And I hope you guys have a wonderful day.